Seven up. Nope, not again. Seven uploads in seven days. Day number three. Let's go. We were up in the St. Joe Benton Harbor area, and I thought it would be a good idea, since we were there anyway, to stop by uh, Walmart or Myers to see if I couldn't find a water bottle cage for my touring bike. I already have two, but I wanted to put a third one on the down tube uh, for fuel. I couldn't believe what I saw when I got there. Now, I wasn't comfortable taking video in the store, but I have some photos I think will be quite enlightening. The first picture here. Yep, that's right. That's a bike rack at Walmart in Benton Harbor. Virtually empty. Let's take a look at the second picture here. Same place, Walmart, on the other side. One bicycle? Now, at Walmart, I didn't look for... I was so shocked I did not look for the water bottle cage, but I don't think there was much on the shelves there. Pretty much sold out. Let's look at the next picture. In Stevensville, I ended up going to the Meyer store. Look what I saw here. More empty shelves. Now, I look for bicycle helmets and bicycle gear. Uh, they had some, but there's still a lot of empty space there. A couple days later, I was curious to see what it was like in Michigan City, Indiana. So I stopped first at the Walmart in Michigan City. There were a few bikes there, but not many. Usually, the bottom and the top racks are completely full of bicycles, but they have been sold out. Let's take a look at uh, the supplies there. Now, they did have a large number of uh, helmets and they did have some bicycle supplies. They didn't have the particular bottle holder that I was looking for. So I figured let's go to Myers in Michigan City. Look at this picture. Empty shelves again. Now, if you notice there were two or three bicycles there Two weeks ago, when we were shopping there, there were none. There wasn't a helmet on the rack. Everything was gone. All the tires were gone. All the tubes were gone. Everything was gone that was on the shelves. I did find one thing, um, and I picked it up and bought it, and that were some Schwinn uh, tire levers. I'll show you those in just a second. I did find these uh, Schwinn tire levers. Um, I really love these things. I have another set on my road bike, but I thought I would get a pair of these for my touring bike. And uh, they're much better than the flat ones I got with my scab patch kits. So I got something out of it. I'll tell you, I don't know if there's anything good coming out of this pandemic, but at least people are getting outside young and old, and they're riding their bikes because it is one thing that we can do. So, let's fight through this thing. We can do it outdoors, get some fresh air, builds a little energy, enjoy the ride, the wind in your hair, what's left of it. Have fun, be safe on your bicycle. Have you ever made the mistake of riding your bike with the wind? Watch this video. I think the poem will say it all.